Welcome to my next deck profile. It's been a while, but today I got my order in of Angel Feathers. So let's go into it. First, we have our Cosmo Healer Egodiel. Three of her we run this build. <coughs> her skill on place. When placed on the Vanguard Seal, choose up to two units from yours or your opponent's rear guards. Put them in the damage zone. If one or more were put, this unit gains a crit. And then the player's units who were put in to the damage, they heal or damage. So yes, it can counter charge your opponent's damage, but you're okay with that. Because you're going to be taking away, it's kind of like pseudo retire, so you are taking away good units off there. Second skill is when it attacks, it gains 5k for each damage and you face up in your opponent's damage zone. So it can become a nice attacker. Second, free Zerakiel. Two, three of our favourite girl, Crimson Impact Metatron. Only two Feather Palace. Then we run for Freeze Ray Granta. He's one of the new units from the new set. His skill, Vanguard Rear Guard went placed from hand. Soul Blast 1, choose one of your opponent's rear guards. Put it into your damage zone. Your opponent chooses a card from his or her damage zone and heals it. So like Zarek, so not Zarek, Egodio's first skill, we get to retire certain units. Yes, they'll get counter shot, but you're all good with that. Okay, the second skill only on rear guard when he attacks. Counter blast one, and this unit will gain 5k for each face up damage in your opponent's damage zone. So it can be a nice grade 2 rush. Next, four of our favourite big attacker. <clears throat> Hygienus Angel. Continuous rear guard, this gains 5k for each card in your damage zone. So you'll get high dam so high damage you'll be like 12k when you're one damage. 22k if you got to four da two three damage. So she's a very so she's there for that beat down attacker. And if you get rushed she can counter down way. Next, three rear Armour Tease. Armour Tease there just as a like because we have Granta he can do stuff. He's just an, a seventh better ride we can have. And he can bring our Feather Palace from damage or any of our units that we really need on the rear. Next, for Heartworth Intendant. Our best first ride. Her skill went rolled upon, put her to damage zone from face down, and then call unit from damage zone. So you'll usually just go call her. Next, for Dispense Angel. Her skill is if you, a new card was put into your opponent's damage zone, she gains 10k. So you just give them a damage, and boom, she's 17k attacker or booster. Next, we Kept with Hesidia because she can put one of our counter charge, count, yeah, counter blasted units back to the hand and make it a free face up unit. Then we got Peniel. Then, this, then four heal, seven critical. So yeah, seven critical, five draw. Yep, that is the list for today. Thanks for viewing my Angel Feather profile.